woke up this morning, I looked outside my window, with children lighting up the Christmas tree, and the snow is falling. Hey you guys, and welcome back to another video. Um, I'm gonna try to hurry up and do this video. I can check and see if the little one, she's still doing remote learning, virtual learning, whatever y'all want to call it. Keep an eye on her. Hold on one second. Halo, stop pulling on that. So, yeah. Let's hurry up and get this video started. So, I am going to be sharing with you all what I'm putting in my kids' stocking stuffer. I'm watching her, okay? Big brother is watching. But, yes. So, this video was long away. You guys always look forward to my what I'm getting my kid for Christmas, which that video is already up. I will have an icon go across, or you definitely can check the link down in the description box where you can get some ideas of what I got my kids for Christmas and hope that it help you out. Um, those are two of my, these are two of my highly requested videos of all time. Um, so I do love to share with you all. So I'm gonna be sharing with you guys of what I'm putting in my kids stocking stuffer. So starting off, I have everything in here. Yes, I know you're like, girl, that's Christmas. I know. Basically, I wanted to share with y'all how I do our stocking stuffer um, ideas. The stocking stuffer is things that come from Santa, okay? So that's why the bag look like it's a little bit healthy and it's a lot of stuff because those are the things that come from Santa, which are smaller items, things that I'm not gonna wrap or things that if I do wrap, she already know what it's gonna be. So there's no point of wrapping it, okay? <laughs> so that's the reason why we do that as well as the really the main reason why I put things from Santa in her stocking is because we know all the kids like to talk, right? When they go back to school or when Christmas day or Christmas morning when they talking to other kids or their family members and they talking about what they got. You don't want to make kids feel bad. Oh, well, why Santa didn't bring me that? Why he bring you that? Well, this is the reason why, okay? So all of the big items are her bulk items. Of course, me and her father gets, um, as well as family members, um, because her family does spoil her as well. But the smaller things definitely come from Santa, you all. Plus look here. Y'all know how I love my black Santa, but don't nobody do for Halo like me, her father, and her family. Okay? <laughs> so, but anyway, this is her stocking. I picked it up over the weekend. Um, I was looking for a stocking. The ones I have there, it, you can't put much in it. You can't put much in this one either. But I see where it had an H on there, and it goes with our colors. So, I got her this one at Target. I can't remember the price. Oh, fifteen dollars. A little bit pricey, but you know, it has a little emblem on it. Plus, I like how it has a little pocket. You can always put something in there as well. Maybe candy and knickknacks and what have you. So this is her stocking for this year. So starting off, first thing we got her was LOL. Y'all, this I'm, I'm really, I'm really really taking a chance on showing you guys this video with Halo being literally a few feet away from me, okay? And she's, she, she's still, she's still at it. Okay, so we, we good. So LOL, this is the a, um, MGA Cares, the LOL badge, has the little face mask and things. I thought this was super cute because I just like, y'all know how I, I think all the dolls and everybody, we got to wear masks. They need to have a mask too. So when I seen this, I knew it would be something that she would like to have, you know, knowing that her dolls have to have a mask. So isn't it cute? And her LOL, she already know what it is. There's no need for me to wrap them up. Okay, the other thing I got here is the Barbie color reveal. The other day, the other morning, she was like, Mama, come here, look at this. And she explained to me, she said, that's pretty neat. Um, I did think about getting her the Barbie color reveal because I do think that they are pretty nice, unique and different. I just didn't hear her talking about it, so I never got, I didn't get it. But since I heard her talking about it, I was like, okay, we'll just get the little one. So we got this one, and I think this one of the new ones is like the little mermaid tail on these. So I got her that. Also got her little Barbie some um, Barbie doll clothes because that's one thing she did ask for on her Christmas list is that she want her Barbies to have clothes 
you guys know my daughter loves i tell you all the time my daughter loves to change out the barbie doll clothes and style them themselves so every time she gets barbie dolls or any dolls the clothes that they come with never stays the same she has to do her own wardrobe okay <laughs> That's just what she does. So she requested and asked for more Barbie doll clothes. This one here is just, I don't know, for a Mickey Mouse doll. Not quite sure um, what this is all about. But I seen the dress. I thought the dress was pretty cute. So I got that. Then, of course, we all seen these um, Barbie doll clothes. And this one is Wonder Woman. Halo does like Wonder Woman. So it has like a little jean jacket and a skirt. And a couple little accessories. So thought that would be neat. Target's a dollar spot. They have these cute little pom-pom pins. I remember having these when I was a kid. If you guys know, I am still in the process of redoing her bedroom. So this will go like on her desk for her to have. So I got these. These were only a dollar at the Target dollar spot. She also asked for some scrunchies. She just liked to put them on her wrist. All the little girls do that. All the kids do that. It's like, no, it goes on your hand. These were $3 at Target and three come in. So it was a dollar each. These beautiful colors be perfect for the springtime and when springtime does come around. So I got her that. Y'all, when I seen this, I was like, oh my goodness, look at this. Look at this. This is a, like the Chinese jump rope now. You old school, you 70s, 80s, maybe 60s too. Baby, you know about this here. Yeah. This is the stuff that I used to play with. Okay, we used to put strings behind a chair. If you was by yourself, I get two chairs. That would be me. And do your Chinese jump rope. You jump in and out of the the uh, strings, and then you step on it. Then you crisscross it. All that good stuff. So I can't wait to show her about my childhood. This was only a dollar, y'all. Walmart. I seen her get up. Oh, shoot. Halo? Mom, the little charger came out, but I don't see no cloud over there. Okay, you guys, I'm back. I digress. Let's move on. Okay, so here, some more Barbie clothing. She always wanted some, she wanted more shoes for her Barbie. But of course, as soon as she's opened this, she ain't gonna even know where none of these are at. But she asked for it. She wanted her Barbie to have more attire so got this at walmart now this is her big item from santa i tell y'all my daughter is six going on 16 and she wants to do everything her older sisters and my niece does okay so she wanted some what are these earbuds ear pods whatever I got the cheapest she wanted for her phone and she wanted some the iPhone ones but I got the cheapest one because honey no okay this does have the built um if this is the charging ones I think yeah it charge it charges to the little pack and all that so I don't know what I'm gonna do with her somebody help me <laughs> but yeah so I found the cheapest one I can find. She does want the ones that have like a little blinged out case. I don't know if she gonna get that or not. I mean, I did see it at Claire's, but I think we are gonna be okay with this and see if she does that, does well with this. Heck, I can bling these out, put some little rhinestones on it myself. Okay, hmm, I think that's what I might do. But yes, this is her big item from Santa in her stocking stuffer. Y'all know I always get down with the get down when it comes to the candy. So I got her some Pock Rocks um, popping candy cane flavor and then gumballs. I like to get these every year for her. It'd be so funny she put it in her mouth and just be trying to chew on it. And Halo loves gum. But I like this one because it has a Santa Claus. They did have a snowman and I think something. I want to say reindeer. But super cute three gumballs in there she also is getting the lol holiday present surprise now if you guys know what well, is already out lol did come out with another winter collection so these are the limited edition the little lols in the ball but they do have bigger ones so we picked her up 
that like i said stuff like this my child already knows what it is there's no need of wrapping it at all i'll be wasting my time trying to wrap it nicely for her plus she already know what it is she gonna be like oh that's a lol that's a lol that's a lol what's the point of wrapping it no we got a reindeer lollipop how cute is that Mr. Potato Head. You know that's something Halo never has asked for is Mr. Potato Head. But I thought this was cute. Oh, there we go. So we got her that. And now you guys can kind of see the reason why the little smaller things I like to put in her stocking stuffer and those are from Santa Claus. So it's not such a big, you know, kinetic sand. When I seen this, I was like, okay. Another thing that I would thought she'd be into, but she never really said nothing about it. She'd be like, oh, that's cool. So they have a rainbow one. A little rainbow unicorn kinetic sand. I figure I will start her off small. Um, I'm kind of over the Play-Doh and, and slime. Um, so I figured the kinetic sand shouldn't be all that bad. I don't know. But um, yeah, I thought this was cute with the little unicorn on it too, coming in a pack and it was only $5. And the last thing I got her is these mini bands. Now, this is a popular item, you all, but with a little bit the older kids for whatever reason, but Halo uses these. These are like mini things around your house. They say for instance, like shampoo, um, food, bacon, um, ice cream that she uses with her Barbies and her um, our generation dolls so they have a series two out so I got that for her uh, so they can have different food and things that they play with in the house so um, that's uh, what I got her so I hope you guys enjoyed this what I am putting in my kids a stocking stuffer haul be sure to give me a great big thumbs up share this video i would truly appreciate it and also i hope that it gives you inspiration or insight or ideas basically on what to put in your kids a stocking stuffer i think this can be co-ed some of the stuff but you get the gist of it i hope you guys enjoyed um until next video i will see you guys later mask ups stay safe until next time and i hope this video it's good. I mean, I don't have my ring lighting, so we're going to work it on now. I'm going to do the best that I can, but I hope you guys got a gist of it. And my dog is barking, so it's definitely time for me to go. Love you all. Stay safe. Until next time. Bye.